here's Gay. Terrific assist. A nice finish. Solid play all around. Yeah, the chemistry has been terrific. Really impressed with their offensive execution. Goodwin kicks to MP. Morris outside. It's MP top of the key. And another three for the Clippers. A much better quarter for them shooting the ball. The Los Angeles Clippers come into this one after the win against the Trailblazers in Portland. Pass to Carter. As Ibuki is screen on Jackson to the middle. Yep, it goes, and the Clipper lead is cut down now to just five in the bucket from Azubuki. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. MP finds Leonard. Back to MP. That falls. Nice feed that time from Leonard. MP's got the lead up to eight now for the Clippers. And you know there aren't many teams with a more dedicated fan base than Utah. The Jazz fans are behind their team no matter what. To the paint, here's Morris, and he uses the glass on the way. And it's a 10-point Clipper lead. Boy, have they gotten hot here in the second quarter. No wonder they're in front. It's always striking, Greg, to see the bond between the Jazz... Form that attachment to their team. Catching up on the changes for Los Angeles. Paul George, he's checked in for Leonard. Norman Powell comes in for Reggie Jackson. And John Wall subbed in for Goodwin. Passed again. Nice ball movement by Utah. Conley kicks to Gay. Harkonnen sets the pick for Gay. Shot clock at six. Over Wall. Off the left rim and out. Well, he's a guy they count on to produce from the mid-range. He doesn't miss too many open looks from there. Dishes it to MP. And they double up MP. And Taylor Horton Tucker is going to pick up the foul. And so it's Los Angeles in control with a nine-point lead to end the quarter. And their three-point shooting has paved the way for him. Back to the action in just a minute. Hey folks, welcome to the Halftime Show. A lead right now in this one for the Los Angeles Clippers. Relying on their subs to carry the load offensively, man. That's their recipe. Some terrific role players on this team, as you would say, Shaq, the others. Yeah, you got a bunch of microwaves on that bench. And let's take a second now to see what the fans are saying on social media. So here's one for Shaq from Dunkmaster J. Shaq, is it true you're the league's all-time MHP? I'm not even sure what that means. Any uh, ideas? Duh, Ernie. Uh, Ernie, it means most handsome player. And I am. That's true. In fact, that's a great question. Wait a minute, wait a minute. How could you know that? Maybe it's the most hairless player or the most hungry player. I got a backup Kenny on this one. And that concludes halftime. Now time to send it over to Kevin Harlan as the game's about to resume. And happy you could join us. We've got two quarters left to go in regulation. You look at MP in this game, guys. He has been everywhere. Yeah, it's been a great... Then for Michael Conley. And then for Los Angeles. MP's checked in for George. Man comes in for Norman Powell, and Reggie Jackson subbed in for John Wall. In decades past, teams that led the league in threes, if they shot that same rate now, would rank Greg dead last in the NBA. So with that thought, which teams of yesteryear probably should have shot more threes? And that's a good one. 
Kevin, I think you got to look back to the run TMC Warriors, right? How about the Larry Bird Celtics? Man, they could knock down the triple. So with George on the bench, here's who Teron Liu is going with. We've got Kawhi Leonard. MP is out there with Morris. Then there's Reggie Jackson, and it's man in at the two. A three from MP. Utah with the rebound. Next up will be a home game matched up against the Pacers. Clarkson dishes to Azabuki. Pull from the top of the key. And it's the Clippers with the rebound. Morris has got four rebounds in this game. Down low, here's MP, and the dunk by MP. Not sure when Kawhi saw him, but the fact is he did, and he delivered. It's a great pass. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively, for sure. 151 left here in the third quarter. Bucket is good. As a book, he's got eight. Willingness to share the ball. Sexton can score and is hungry to do so. You got to keep your teammates happy. Brent, looking back, the Clippers have really put things together over the last decade. They have injuries have been a factor the past couple of seasons, so they haven't competed at the level certainly that their owner wants to. But they're trying to keep this core group of guys together. And uh, if they do that and they get health, there's a lot of talent there and a lot of guys who've done it on the biggest of stages. Arkanen passes to Azabuki. Over Morris. Azabuki, no good. Clippers leading by eight. Jackson kicks to MP. Carter pulls it in. And so it's Carter who brings the ball up for the Utah Jazz. Pass to Markinen. Sexton with it. To the middle. Looking for Markinen. He gets it there. Over Morris. Markinen can't get it to go. L.A. has gone into a slump here from three-point range, shooting just one of five here in the third. M.P. with a screen on Carter. Jackson kicks to M.P. In it goes for the eighth time in ten tries. And good recognition from Reggie, open teammate. About seven seconds separating the shot and game clocks. The pass to Clarkson. Back to Sexton. Markinen sets the pick for Sexton. Passes it to Markinen. The three. No good on the shot. MP against Clarkson. MP passes to Mann. And we're going to have a jump ball. It's tied up there. A three from Morris. No good on the last second attempt there. And as we end the third quarter, a double. So it's Los Angeles winning this one easily. A resounding victory for them. And Greg in enemy territory, no less. And that's exactly right. But with the way they controlled the game and, and just completely took the crowd out of it, that's how to get it done on the road. And that'll do it, folks. For Brett Berry, Greg Anthony, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. See you later.
great game, <laughs> MP. Really well done. Thank you, Coach. Thank you. Thank you. Next game, you're back with the starters. Don't lie to me, Coach. Do not lie to me. No cap. <laughs> I see you. I just told the press during my availability. Uh -huh. So why don't you head over there and answer some of their questions and uh, bask in the glory. All right, now, that's not a bad idea there. <laughs> You've earned it. Now go enjoy it. Hello, who's got questions for me? Oh, is that my man John in the cut back there? Ah, my man, it's always good to see you, what's up? Hey, it's me, man, great game, MP. Thank you, man. So, Coach Graves just let us know that uh, you're back in the starting lineup. Yeah. First off, did he tell you yet? And if so, how does that feel? Yeah, he just let me know, man, and it, that, it feels good. It feels real good, you know, but that's never been my main goal in this league. You know, I just want to contribute to winning basketball. So if that means, you know, playing with the starters or coming off the bench, it don't make a difference to me, man. But I'm in that starting lineup, so I'm hyped. So are you aware of reports that you've been placed back in the starting lineup so they can actually showcase you for a potential trade? Um, no. Uh, that's actually the first time I've actually heard that. Well, let me read this to you. Sources familiar with the organization's thinking have confirmed that there's interest in acquiring Shep Owens in the trade. So how do you feel about that? It's surprising. I mean, you'd literally be swapping someone who's shown he knows how to win in this league for someone who's mostly potential. Ah, uh, well, not to throw salt on the wound, I'm also hearing that Shep was Othello Akpin's first choice at 18, but Phil Boyer overruled him. <laughs> uh, I mean, if that's true, you know, those things happen. Not everyone's gonna evaluate talent the same way heading into the draft. I would just hope that I've done enough since then to show that I belong here and can help build a winning culture for this team. All done? All right, thanks guys. Okay, I gotta address the elephant in the room. Uh, it's all over the news. What's up with these trade rumors? Are we worried about them? Mm. Worried? What do we have to be worried about? Shep's a star in any city he's mm -hmm. in. Yeah. I am the marquee. Mm -hmm. That's right. So, honestly, it's a little insulting that someone thinks they can trade MP for me, straight mm -hmm. up. Plus That's... draft picks. <laughs> I'm in a class by myself. Man, I'm not even in the class. Mm. I'm floating above the whole class system. Mm. Ooh, don't look down. Oh, wow. Man, y'all look like ants from up here. Mm, red ants. <laughs> it don't matter what color the ants are, Pook. Why you always gotta take it far? I was just riffing. Man, sit down and stay in your lane. How many times I gotta tell you that? He doesn't like ants. Stay in your lane. Hey, Chip, why don't we get some uh, some picks? Yeah, let's do that. Hey, you the show, baby. Oh, okay. he doesn't care. Yeah, he doesn't yeah, care. care. Yeah. 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 MP, who's the MP? Who's the MP? Who's the MP? Who's the MP? Come on, man. Come on, man. I'm in the presence of greatness right now, baby. Come on, play with me.
Freddy Novak was talking about you on the Flex. <laughs> That's a good guy to have in your corner. Okay, um, you guys want to fill me in? Why do I feel like I was blindsided out there? Because you were. Look, but that's okay, all right? It's the last trick Othello's got up his sleeve. Yo, fam, he's really gonna offer three first-round draft picks on top of me. For Shep? I mean, is Phil even gonna sign off on that? It's unclear. Well, there's more support for the trade on social than I would like to see. What does that mean? I'd say it's about a 50-50 split at this point. Good thing social isn't in charge of the roster. <sighs> well, I... it's... Look, it still wouldn't hurt to fight that battle, so... Okay, but we've already talked about this. We're not gonna fight this fight in the press. I'm not talking press, I'm talking about on the court. Look, Othello put his cards on the table. It's you versus Shep now. Okay, hasn't it always been? Yeah, but never this directly. Look, you've got an opportunity to put this thing to bed once and for all. All you've got to do is outperform Shep. Mm -hmm. Boya hasn't pulled the trigger yet, which means he's still not sold. But there's a microscope on you two now. Look, if you go out there and you whoop Shep's behind on the stat sheet, there's no way Phil would trade you. Rick, Look, how could he? Rick, you know I'm not about the stats, man. I've never been about that. Okay. But you are about this city. I know you're a team first guy on P, but I don't see anything wrong with calling your number a little more than usual if it's gonna get you to stay. You okay. can't win a ring in this city if Othello trades you. So it's me versus Shep. Mm -hmm. It's you versus Shep, babe. You gotta end this, MP. Once and for all.
<laughs> this is it. Okay. It's the classic, man. Oh, Hammond classic. Park. We made it, baby. Uh, Social is aware that you have arrived. Okay. At Shep Squad 100 just posted. Walked past MP outside. Mm -hmm. Dude looks shook. Nah, I ain't worried about that. What in the world, man? Y'all weren't lying, man. <laughs> People treat this thing like... It's the biggest thing in the world. <laughs> yeah. But this is what we wanted, you know? Oh, yeah. So should we go in? I don't want anybody else to accuse me of looking shook out here. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do it. After you, big guy. <sighs> Let's get it. Chuck Willow. Shouldn't you be hiding in the bushes taking pictures of D-list celebrities? Yeah, well, everybody's got to start somewhere, Ashley. I mean, we all can't flunk out of fashion school like you. Mila, looking good, baby girl. You literally make my skin crawl. We know that's not true. <laughs> if it isn't sweet little Ricky. Barbara Berry. Do you miss turning down Barbara Berry and Associates yet? Or are you having fun running babies first? Big boy sports agency. <laughs> you know, I could never work somewhere where we had to accept money from Shep Owens to keep the lights on. Oh, well. But I'm glad it's working out for you. I see. Well, his money is as green as MPs, and guess what? There's a lot more of it. I hope that helps you sleep at night. Oh, <gasps> like a baby. Yo, I'm sorry about that, man. I'm not trying to be a distraction for you right now. What? That bizarre wall entourage showdown? Yeah. <laughs> man, that was funny. Oh, so you loose. I'll take it. Oh, man, I do this, man. I'm hyped right now. All right, that's good, because it's game time. Yes, Actually, sir. you should go tell Kenny that you're ready to get it started. Let's get it. <laughs> I'm going to see you out there. I'll see you, man. Solid entrance. I've seen better. I've seen worse. Hey, man, I'm just hoping my game can do the talking, man. Now, MP, don't be afraid of a little showmanship out mm -hmm. there, all right? The people love when you put on a good show. Oh, oh, Mr. Cruz, man, I'm about to put the game of a lifetime on, man. Okay. I just hope they're ready out look, there. Look, look, you got to win two to face the returning champs, okay? <laughs> now, that's Shep Squad. They're Six. in green. Winners, they get the green jerseys. All right. Okay? <laughs> All right, like the masses, right? Masses? What you talking about, golf? MP, look, yeah. I don't know what you're talking about, man. The winners get the green jerseys, as in money, the almighty dollar. Yeah, that, that was my next guess, but... <laughs> I, don't, I, I don't know where your head is at sometimes, young man. Mr. Cruz, I, I got it. Win the next two games, then I get to embarrass Shep in front of his biggest fans. Is that what you're saying? That is what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. And then you're going to get that championship belt. Mm -hmm. But right now it belongs to Shep, and he's going to have to give it to you, okay? Now that is if you win. <sighs> love it. Love it. You love it? Love it. Get on out there. Game's about to start. Come on now. I know. Hey, I'm going to see you in the winner's circle, all right? That's right. That's a horse, horse reference. Get out there, MP. Yes, sir. Stop making jokes and all kind of... Hussy, Tussy, whatever you're doing. The energy in here is wow, bro. I haven't felt like this in a minute. I'm saying, bro. Yo, again, thank you for doing this for me, man. Like, coming out here and supporting your boy. I thought you were here to support me. Oh, me supporting you? Seeing as <laughs> I'm your hero, your mentor, <laughs> whatever you want to call it. <laughs> Yo, T-Mac, you crazy, man. Listen, but I need one thing for you. Dominate your matchup, please. Because I got mine on lock. Can you do that for me? Who? KG? KG. Dude's a puppy dog. Huh? <laughs> I got this. Keep that same energy, all right? <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> Let's get this done, man. Let's get it.
14. That's what's up, boy. And what I tell you, Come on, Mike man. Hey, 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 you did your thing out there. I ain't gonna lie to you. Like what I saw. You kind of holding back on us. Listen, T-Mac, man, I'm trying to save something for the finale, man. I, I don't want to hear that, bro. Don't hold back too much, all right? I'm not trying to leave here without the green jersey. Man, come on, we got this, man. All right, let's get it. Let's serve. Good, my boy. Oh, JG, man. Good What's game. going on? Oh, Y'all appreciate it, man. You uh, you came to watch? Yeah, no, nah, I came to play. A word? Yeah. Who you with? I'm your boy, Shep. <laughs> my boy, Shep. You with my boy, Shep? Yeah. First off, that's not my boy. And second of all, I kind of like you, but I'm going to have to violate you now. Yeah, but you know that's not going to happen. Yeah, I... Nice work in that first game. Thank you. I think I even heard a few cheers for uh, you. No, nah, man, you heard more than a few. <laughs> okay, okay. I like the confidence, but don't get too cocky on me now. You still got to win one more to get to Shep, and it ain't going to be easy. Ah, take it one game at a time, Kenny. I got it. But uh, don't try to ride on my focus, man. Who, me? Little old Kenny? I would never do nothing like that. <laughs> Why do I feel like you like poking people, pushing them and seeing what they made of? Maybe so. Uh-huh. Maybe so, but look, we don't have time for that right now. You got to get over and get to that next game. Now, good luck in there. You're going to need it. Thank you. Stay focused, kid. Yes, sir. Like your work. You ready to dominate? Hey, fam, I'm not walking up that court with an L. No, sir. We about to dominate. Hey, man, I'm about to dial us up to a 10 right now. Can you keep up, old man? You lead, I follow. Huh, say that again. You lead, I follow. All right, then. Hey, we got this. Let's do it. Huh. Yes, sir. Huh. Huh.
Hold on now. Now that's what I'm talking about, T-Mac. Who's an old man again? Uh, I don't see one where he at. Not on my team, huh? Not right here. That's right, that's my right. guy. Hey, hey. You ready for that green jersey? I already know what I'm going to wear. Mm. When we out celebrating. Ooh. Got everything picked out. The shoes, uh -huh. earrings, the hat, the boots, the boots. Talk to him. Hey, but hold on. One more game. We got to lock him. I saw Shep over there giving an interview for his reality show, and I'm telling you, I heard him say he locked me up. Rick, you don't fights. gotta gas me up, bruh. I got all the ammo that I need. He did an impression of you that's all over social. 
Yeah, he made the face you make when you're focusing really hard. It was actually pretty good. Ooh, I thought you liked that face, though. Babe, I love that face, uh -huh. but it was really good. I mean, look, imitation is the sincerest form of flattery. Well, listen, he about to get the most sincere form of a beatdown. Yeah, okay. don't say that, man. This camera's filming you. Don't. Oh, I don't care. I'm here to win a game, not the Oscars. That, that, that is good. good. Actually, good. you know what? Matter of fact, go out there right now and say that, because I think they're ready for you. Whew. You got this, MP. I got this. There you go. Hey, you ready for this? Am I ready? I'm so. always ready. Are you ready for Chef? Oh, I'm going to save it this one, man. <laughs> I might even let him score a few extra points just so the game don't end too soon. There you go. I want the people to get their money's worth out here. You do know this is free, right? I'm going to still light him up, man. That's it. <laughs> Come on. Go out there and show him what you got, young blood. Yes, hey, and I'm really looking forward to that championship belt, too. So, old man, get your popcorn ready. Because it's showtime. All okay, right? Okay. I do like some popcorn. In fact, I love popcorn. Go ahead, young blood. You ready to get humiliated? I'm ready to shut you up, kid. How you gonna do that? Hmm. You know your weak game ain't gonna do it. Tuh. Well, I guess you gotta watch and find out, huh? And good thing you got front row seats to this one. <laughs> Light work, son. Oh, yeah? <laughs> you still got your cameras rolling? Because I don't want nobody missing this big fat L that I'm about to send you home with, kid. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so you tough now. You know what? <laughs> I'm gonna see you out there. Yeah.
Come on, man. They can't match up to us. He don't want no. Oh, come on, man. They can't match up to us. He don't want no.
right, all right, all right. Listen up. Ladies and gentlemen of Hammond Park, I present to you the one and only, the heart and soul of this city, the captain of this year's classic championship squad, MVP! Let's go! Hey, Chuck, you in your boy's face, man? That's priceless. Oh, man. Yo, real talk, man, Chef. Heck of a job out there, man. It was fun battling with you. I don't need that. Thank you, brother. Mr. Kenny Cruz, man, thank you. You class act. You earned thank it. Thank you, thank you, yeah, thank man, you. Yeah, man, you earned it. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Go ahead, take your bow. Woo!